Good day, good day! How the honk are ya? This is your friend Dan O, and this is Roverland, the YouTube channel that's anything and everything Land Rover. Have I got a video for you today? All right, all right, all right. Welcome, welcome, welcome to a one of Wednesday, one of Wednesday. Now you're saying Dan O. I see more than one, but yes, this is an exciting one. Hey, what we've got today is something that I just picked up from uh, Dollar General. Yes, it's a, uh, I don't know what they call them really, but they're dollar store, but things don't cost just a dollar. But anyway, <laughs> trying to explain the American uh, uh, social system. No, anyway. All right, what we're gonna talk about is these little buggers right here. So I went over to the shelf because uh, I want to kind of recap of what we've had in the past. And you can see on here that these buggers are $5 and they're from the Dow Gen Corp uh, LLC, you can see here. And they're from uh, Goodletteville, Tennessee, made in China. And what we have today is a Welly. And uh, made in China, this is the Range Rover Sport. And uh, this thing here is a security tag. So you can see electronically protected. That's good because it's a Range Rover. But look at this beauty. Actually, uh, you know, getting ready for this video, I went over to the shelf and pulled out uh, all these uh, that I had because, you know, obviously we've got something new to show you. And I had forgotten about this color isn't this grand isn't this glorious and uh, these come with opening doors this is a left hooker now yeah, the door doesn't shut very well because of this uh, security thing is in the door it actually um, I just took one of these off not too long ago Let's see if we get it in in focus but they put it right on the uh, door hinge so it's actually in the door hinge and it's pretty secure uh yeah if you have watched recently um they have flooded the market on these orange ones yeah they are just this orange is uh wow yeah it, even though they're still five dollars they just went to town on these orange ones i have so many orange ones that it's just kind of uh ridiculous uh, that they went to town on this. So let's take a look. So you, you, you've seen this before. These are pullback units. Whoa. And uh, really kind of cool. They, they really are a decent toy for $5 pullback. It does have some pretty good details. I mean, the undercarriage is really, really accurate as far as I know. Not that I've ever gone and, uh, you know, looked up underneath the skirt of one of these. But they have some really nice detail. Let's start at the front. There's the Range Rover on the nose of the hood. Little badging on the uh, grill there. Little Land Rover badge there. For some reason we're kind of having problems focusing today, but hey, we'll get there. Lens headlights. This has got the, like the, it mimics the LED headlights. And uh, like I said, it's uh, very, very nice. Got some accent black parts in here. I think some of these are uh, inserts, just like the headlights. They put them in there, but uh, no added details for the uh, the vent gill there. But uh, matching uh, was that side mirror to the body paint. It's not just black. And uh, just a really nice panoramic. Uh, sunroof on the top very nice uh, dash on there you can see that there's a stick sh stick uh, uh, shift lever very nice seats and this is kind of the unique thing is they got a little package in the back seat that they kind of use that's kind of a neat thing um, no rear opening trunk or anything like that or, or rear tailgate once again, we've got the Range Rover on the back tailgate. And then uh, I'm not really sure what that says on there. Boy, that's really fine print. Oh, Sport. Yeah, Sport. And you see the tail lens there. So very, very nice. And then on the other side, it has 
I believe that's the black Range uh, Land Rover badge, the black one. That's usually what uh, Range Rover uses. Not the green oval, but the black oval. No, uh, I mean, it's got the uh, dual exhaust mufflers there, but no t uh, chrome tips. But uh, very, very nice. I love this color. Like I said, I had forgotten how cool uh, these things could really be and how, you know, the, the color of them. Uh, very nice classic uh, Range Rover wheels. I like those. They're not uh, too big. They fit the wheel well really, really nice. Good tread on them. They're not uh, mud tires or anything like that. The uh, no uh, uh, chrome or anything on the back side of that side mirror, but that's all right. That's something that's easily done with a chrome pen. But yeah, it's really nice. Got the metal door with an insert, door insert, which is, I think, different than even the glass piece. I think this is like three pieces, the metal, the door, the, the window, and then the door skin. Yeah, so it's really kind of a nice piece, you know. But yeah, just a beautiful color there. I really like that color. Very, very sharp. So anyway, so that, I believe, is what I found as uh, the first edition. And uh, very, very few. I have very few of these. But in the next, well, year or two or whatever, they have come out with this orange one. And uh, matter of fact, over here in the studio, you can see over here, I just picked one up not too long ago. Uh, also, you know, just that orange and it's the same thing from then till now. It's just because this one is an old one that I pulled off the shelf and that, it's, it's the same darn tootin' thing, same security tag and everything, you know? So yeah, I got that sitting over there, but, uh, really kind of cool. So let's get to the uh, subject of the day. I just found this the other day. And uh, I really thought, all right, cool, we're going to be, yeah, this is awesome. And Dollar General, Dollar General usually has a pretty good uh, selection. Uh, but bam, check it out. Dude, look at that. We've got a white one now. Yeah, Irish colors. Yeah. Uh, shout out to Pauly out there in Ireland. Yeah. But bam, look at that. So here we are, same basic things. I don't think there's any upgrades or anything like that. Just a basic thing, just change the color. Still left hooker, yeah, okay. Uh, still a package in the back. Panoramic roof with the sun, with the glare of the lights. <laughs> but uh, yeah, very, very nice, very sharp. Once again, just quality product. You know, five dollars. I mean, that's not bad. I mean, this is what one forty-third scale, thereabouts. You know, this thing never does tell us what real size they have or anything like that on here. But uh, yeah, so I, I, you know, it's not too bad. A lot of times, like Walgreens or whatnot, they'll have, uh, you know, five ninety-nine or two for ten. But uh, for the wellies, they they sometimes have wellies. In them with the here's the part number four eight nine or eight was that an eight yeah I believe that's an eight yep yep six nine or eight four eight is that or three four three six nine or eight good thing we got that out of the way all right so anyway so there we go this is kind of neat the one on Wednesday we got a white one now in the welly. Um, but I got to confess to you, <laughs> yeah, those stinkers over to Welly and, uh, Dollar General. Yeah. I guess what I found on the shelf when they go to get all these. Yeah. But bam. Yeah. They were already put this out in white here. I thought we added a new color to it and all they're doing is resurrecting <laughs> the same. One of the first colors, I, I really do believe the green one was the first one, then it came out with the white one, uh, it, or thereabouts, and, and then the orange one hold it for quite a few years, and they really flooded the market with that. So, I really thought we were going to get something new and exciting, and uh, well, an exciting one of Wednesday, hopefully it was still exciting, 
But uh, yeah, they're the same darn tootin' thing. I was kind of kind of disappointed, but not because I don't have too many of the uh, white ones. And uh, maybe they'll get back and, and do the green ones again. So maybe there's hope that we can, uh, you know, get as many of these uh, green and white ones as I do the orange ones. Yeah. Uh, well, there you go. Thanks for joining me on a one up Wednesday. Um, make sure you're giving me a big thumbs up. Oh, I got to remember, come on over to Facebook and post what you got. Uh, do you have any more different colors? Any more colors? Any different colors of these? Go over there and post them for me, will you? I'd like to see what uh, what I'm missing. All right, let's get a close-up shot of this as we get out of here. And that's it for uh, One Up Wednesday. Thanks for joining me. And remember, slow traffic, keep right, and have a great rubber day.